So I recently got this Squire Classic Vibe Stratocaster to see what all the fuss is about. It plays really well and it sounds really good. But there is an issue that I've identified. It's, it's this. In this old house of mine, even though the wiring's been updated, single coil pickup guitars make a hideous amount of 60 cycle hum depending on the pickup settings. In this case, positions one, three, and five all hum like crazy. It really limits what I can do with this guitar. I've only got two of the five pickup positions that I can use. Well, Sweetwater Sound, the sponsor of today's video, came to my rescue and they sent me a Fishman Fluence loaded Stratocaster pickguard. So I'm really excited to install it in this guitar to see if it solves the noise issue and also to check out the other tonal possibilities. So I'm gonna get to work and I'll be right back. All right, it's about two hours later and I've got the Fishman Fluence loaded pickguard installed on my classic Vibe Stratocaster. So I do wanna mention before we do tones that I did get the optional battery pack that installs in place of the stock tremolo cover on the Strat. It's really nice, you just use a USB cable to plug in and recharge the battery for the circuit. First up, let's see if these pickups resolve the 60 cycle hum issue I have in this old house. I've got my distortion pedal turned on and I'm just gonna raise the volume and flip through the five pickup selector positions. Here we go. Oh yes, blessed, well, it's not silence, blessed hiss from my distortion pedal. Yeah, it really does resolve a lot of noise issues with standard traditional single coil Strat pickups. All right, now on to some tones. The first we're going to examine is what Fishman calls kind of that classic single coil sound. And I'm just gonna go through the five pickup selector options and we'll see what we get with a kind of just slightly gritty ampy tone. Here we go, starting with the neck pickup. Kind of a classic Strat neck pickup sound. Here is the neck and middle pickups together. Yeah, a little quacky and pretty mellow. Here is the middle pickup by itself. Sounds like a Strat middle pickup to me. Here is the bridge and middle pickups together. Quack galore, oh yeah. And then finally, here's the bridge pickup. These are some nice tones. I'm gonna to go ahead and engage the distortion pedal and play a little bit of lead. And I hope you'll forgive me, but I'm gonna turn just a little bit of delay on. I have to have some delay. But again, I'll just quickly flip through the different pickup selector options. <laughs> Yeah, 
there's some great tones there, and I haven't even twisted either of the tone knobs. Real quick, if I turn down the neck pickup tone knob and put the selector switch so we have both the neck and middle pickups, here's what we get. <laughs> Yeah, there's a lot there. Oh yeah, a lot there. How about the Hot Texas single coil mode? That's what they call it. A little more gain, a little more oomph. You access it by using the pull pot uh, on the bottom. So this would be your second tone knob. Just pull it out and we get a little more oomph. So here's the, we'll start with the bridge pickup. Let me turn off the uh, delay. Let me turn off Hot Texas and go back to Classic. Hot Texas. You can hear there's a little more gain and a little more crunch going on. All right, let's try the neck pickup. Back to Classic. Back to Hot Texas. Yeah, again, if I add in that distortion, I'm gonna, let's just do the neck pickup with the tone rolled down just a little bit. There's some really nice hot Texas tones in there. I think my temptation is going to be to leave it turned on all the time. <laughs> However, we have another mode to look at, and that's a high frequency tilt. That's accessed by pulling out the middle knob, so the tone knob for the neck pickup. So th what this one does is just change the tonal character of the high frequencies. It's a little subtle. Hopefully you'll be, you'll be able to hear this um, across YouTube's audio. All right, so here's the bridge pickup in standard mode. And just think about those high tones that you're hearing, the high frequency. Let's try the high frequency tilt. Let's try the regular mode again. High frequency tilt. So I don't know what you're hearing, but what I'm hearing here in the studio is just a little bit of a darker tone. It's that upper, upper frequency. It's probably what, above 5K, you know, that kind of crispy sheen stuff that's just tame down a little bit. And this can be good if you're playing a lot of lead on that bridge pickup in particular because there's no tone control connected to the bridge pickup itself. So you can really kind of tame the high frequency a little bit if you need to. Here is a lead tone without the high frequency tilt with the bridge pickup. <laughs> Let's turn on that high frequency tilt. It's subtle, but it's there. It just tames it a little bit. Pretty cool.
So lots of great sounds in the loaded Fishman Fluent Single Coil Pick Guard, whatever the right way to say that is. Oh yeah, it's really going to change the way I use this value-priced Squire Vibe Classic Stratocaster. It really is. Also, are you, are you interested in P90 pickups? I've got a video here demoing Fishman's Fluence P90 style pickups. Check it out. I'll see you over on that video.